most people ask me when I do T-bar rolls why I use the 25s and the 35s and not the 45s. The 45s are a hell of a lot of more weight, but if you notice when people use the 45, the weight doesn't move as much. The, the, the stretch, retraction, contraction is not far of a distance. So when you use smaller weight, meaning the 35s and 25s, you get a deeper stretch and you get a deeper retraction, contraction coming up above right here. When you're here and you bend over here, look at the stretch is here. If I had 45s on here, it would have been already touching the ground. So therefore I have to bring my chest up a little higher. I don't want that. I want the full range of motion. So I want to come here with the 35 and I can bring it here. Meaning I can bring it closer to my body. With the 45s, I'm getting about right here. With the 35, 25s here, I'm getting a deeper stretch in my lats when I'm doing it with the smaller weight. So you might want to think next time you do T-bar rows, do you want to ego lift and use 45s? Or do you want to scale down the weight and get a better contraction in the muscle, build the muscle, and overall get full range of motion and a better all workout, you know what I'm saying? So you're either a weightlifter or you're a bodybuilder. If you want exercises like this that's going to maximize your muscle and strength growth and a free diet plan done by a dietitian, go download my training app. Link is in the bio, baby.